Would it be possible someday to create superheroes using genetic engineering? In the comic book X-Men, superheroes carry the X gene, which gives them their mutant abilities. Such a gene doesn't exist in humans as is purely fictional. Humans, however, do possess skills that appear to be like superhuman abilities. For example, Tim Dreyer of Johannesburg, South Africa has a genetic mutation that makes his bones denser than normal. Scott Flansberg from New York is described as a human calculator with the ability to calculate numbers in his head at a lightning speed. Stephen Pete of Washington State has a genetic mutation in the SCN9A gene and subsequently doesn't feel any pain. Veronica Seider of Stuttgart, Germany, is believed to have the best eyesight in the world. She's able to identify individuals from a mile away. Despite the rarity of these mutations, there could be a chance to deliberately introduce genetic mutations into humans. For instance, a 2016 study found that muscle growth can be induced by manipulating a gene called ACVR2B. This gene codes with a receptor that inhabits a naturally occurring protein that limits muscle growth. This would allow humans to develop an incredible muscle mass amounting to super strength. Scientists also believe that they can help the visually impaired by giving them ultrasonic hearing, similar to dolphins and bats. They believe that the Preston protein, encoded by the SLC26A5 gene, is key to achieving this superhuman ability. Super speed may also be achieved through the removal of a gene called NCOR1. Scientists found that mice ran twice as fast when they removed their NCO1 gene. The genome editing technology is already being used to repair single gene disorders such as cystic fibrosis, Huntington's disease and sickle cell disease. It's possible that humans could someday borrow super strengths from other species. For example, tardigrades are known as the toughest creatures on Earth. They can resist high radiation and survive in the vacuum of space. Scientists genetically engineered human cells to produce a tardigrade protein, which gave human cells the ability to resist radiation by up to 40%. Gene editing techniques may turn the next generation into superhumans by giving them the option to choose their abilities from a catalog. However, this would have to be done at an embryonic state to ensure that all the 37 trillion cells of the adult human are genetically modified.